What's happening everybody, it's your guy Sai, and welcome to Perfect Spot. I found this game on itch.io, and it has the description. Perfect Spot is a very short horror game, which includes mild jump scares, loud sound effects, and atmospheric horror elements. Basically, you can say it is somewhat a cliche game. There are no notes to read, no dialogue, only your interpretation of the story. The duration is about 5-10 to 10 minutes, has two endings, and playing in the dark with headphones is recommended. So. That's all we know about the game so far, so let's see how we interpret this game. Without further ado, let's go! What is a perfect spot? It is a place where you make the best memories, while the rest are silent. Find a perfect spot. Let's see what it says. Missing people. Got the whip ski. Okay, got the four door. Got the leaf pile, got the trash. I'm gonna jump in there. Can I pick this up? Nope. Okay, guess I'm finding the perfect spot. They said the perfect spot is somewhere where you can make new memories while the rest are silent. I don't know why I'm here for that. But there's nothing but memories here. Got the nameless gravestones. It's a nice fountain though. Can I get in? Dip my toes a little bit. What's up, fool? It's pretty cool. Nice statue. Where's your hand at? Got to hand it to you. It's a pretty good looking game. For the love of God! Please! I feel like the style works pretty well. What is this? Get a shovel from the car. Okay. Are they reusing the missing people? Why would they put them all through this cemetery? These are side by side. They're just lazy. Alright, get a shovel. Can you dig it? Damn! Dang, I think I used that pun too early. From the car, I assume it's to be in the trunk. Yep. You never know. But me personally, I'm gonna put it in the trunk. And I am a floating shovel now. Got a nice set of trees here. They all look the same, more or less. Dig up the spot. Get the body from the- oh, okay. We're finding a perfect spot to dump the body. I said there's no dialogue, so I'm gonna make the dialogue. After hours and hours of finding and driving to this abandoned cemetery, finally, I can get rid of the victim's body. Can I put it down? Am I a walking corpse now? Dang! Someone do some pixel measurements and figure out how tall this person is. Here's a gravestone next to it. You know? Yeah, figure that out. <laughs> For what reason? Don't ask me, bro. I'd... Where did... Oh, you're over here. Did I not peep that before? I mean, obviously, that's a horror element, but it doesn't really phase me. Alright, let's put it on in here. Pre repent your sins in church. I'm not going to bury it before I repent. That's the church. It's very... Is it a church? Whoa! I'm good. We're fine. We're fine. Just a little jumpy scare. I'm okay. So now I'm believing that I'm responsible for most, if not all, of these missing persons, people's posters. Maybe. All right. Whoa. This is not a church. Mm, they knew I was gonna want to leave, man. They knew it. All right. I guess we're in it now. 
I can't sprint anymore. These are my victims. I'm starting to understand now. What is wrong with me? Nope. Nope. At least I saw you coming. Are you... Oh, you're moving. What's up, fool? You waving? Nice to meet you. My name's Sai. How's it hanging? I'm not turning around. Oh, it's a key. Oh, that's fine. I needed that. All good. All good. Got some heads upside down. Maybe these are actually all my victims. Dang, I was kind of hoping they would have physics. They just kind of dangle in their own, in their own ways. Whose face is this? Hmm. Is this what repenting feels like? It's not how I feel when I repent. We're good. Nope. All right, no turning back. Got a lot of whispers. Didn't really sign up for all this. Stab. I'm not turning around. They were gonna make me turn around. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not gonna trip if there's something behind me this time. Okay, but you should let me go though. All right, guess we're going back. Mess with these bags. I have to stab this bag. All this whispering for what, bro? Messing with the bags. Guess I'm going back. Did I break something? Stop bothering me, bro. Oh, is there. I thought there was something here. No? I'm clicking on all the bags. Hmm. Is it just gonna. Will it help? Oh, a knife. You're stupid. <laughs> let's, let's just get that out the way. Your buddy thinks you're stupid. He's not really feeling you right now. There we go. I stabbed the bags. So I can just get the stab as much as I want. Hang on. Hit. All right. That's enough stabby. Stabby. Give you a little pokey poke. Mm. Oh, there we go. So I had to stab to get the key? How does that make sense? I didn't even see a lock on this door, though. Not this time. Still can't sprint. I feel like if each of these posters only came up once regularly in the graveyard, they would be a lot more bothering to see copies of them inside you know what i mean and now we're in the red room <laughs> okay so i guess i got you know i was looking for an excuse to get out of there so now we can get in the car and leave i guess that's one ending i'm gonna get you guys the other ending where we go forward and repent all right this time we're going forward. Y'all see that? Oh, it's just a statue. What's up, statue? Still missing that hand, I see. So I called the police on myself?
Or they found me. It's up to my interpretation, and yours. Well, that's the other ending. Pretty good game. It was made in four days, so I say it was pretty good for four days, for sure. But that is for this video. If you liked it, please be sure to drop a like. If you disliked it, leave a dislike. Leave a comment. Let me know how you, what you thought about it. Subscribe today to become a hero. But that is for this video, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. And I can't wait for our next adventure.